centuries ago, Japan was unified under the Tokugawa Shogunate. It closed its doors to the rest of the world, and for a time, the island nation prospered. <laughs> Yet despite its apparent tranquility, conflict brewed beneath the surface. Lords known as Daimyo were kept under strict surveillance. In public, they were loyal. But the coals of discontent were slowly being fanned towards conflagration. Deep in the mountains of Kurosu, weapons were secretly forged in preparation for rebellion. Shogun's forces got wind of the plan and took terrible and bloody reprisals. the Veiled Edge. Skilled in Lord Subterfuge in the way of the sword, these nameless assassins were unmatched in their abilities. Under the tutelage of a master, the Blade, they honed their skills in pairs called Blade Twins. Go! Separately, formidable. Together, unstoppable. Blade twins are forever tied together by the bonds of fate. Great white whale that's eluded all others. But my vision is clear, and my harpoon ready. Huh? Assassins! <laughs> <laughs>
truly a pitiful sight. That was the only trace that remained. One, don't forget this. <sighs> Just as I suspected. You mean to abandon the clan and search for them? They are still alive. I have to. Have you forgotten the code? ever since I took you in. Ever since I lost my blade twin, I've had to live with the pain of surviving. Go! Succeed where I have failed.
Someone just doesn't know when to quit. It seems you might also have a story to tell. I know. Tag along with me, will you? This way! This way! Come on! far surpass us in terms of strength. If we do not catch up, we are surely done. That is why we must do what we can to learn from them. What are to affect true change? Wow. They have quite something. The black ships return, seeking the prize of a commercial treaty between America and Japan. With the city in tumult, the figures who will shape Japan's future gather in Yokohama. Did you get your picture? Huh? Who are you? Come to the garden now. Admit it. You're a spy for the Shogunate. I'll cut you down. I'm about to unleash my most deadly technique. Well, well, look who it is. What uh, are you doing out here? Nothing important. Ah, oh no, did Katsura pick a fight with you? So you know him? Oh, I know him, all right. 
This is the guy who's been helping me look for Master Shoin. Katsura here is an old student and close friend of his. <laughs> this guy never learns. Just the other night, he got dead drunk and danced around naked before falling into a pond. Oh. Oh. I'm sorry. I had an important matter to attend to. Look to the drinks. Next round on me. <laughs> you won't lay a finger on me. In spite of Harris's close call, the Treaty of Amity and Commerce was concluded at last. In the end, the Imperial Court did not assent. We did all we could to explain, but our words fell on deaf ears. And now, there are those who would have our heads, who believe we have slighted the Imperial Court. There is no other way. Should the time come when we must atone for this deed, I alone shall pay the price. With this momentous agreement, Japan opened up to the world. So, how do you plead? Have I not made myself clear? The Shogunate serves a purpose no longer. That is why I urge our people to rise decisively as one. It is they who must build this nation anew. What can the people possibly do? They must stand behind the Shogunate, or we all fall to the foreigners. You wish to keep our country safe? Then the people must fall in line. So this is the nation you want. A land of purges and repression. Your insolence and insubordination are unforgivable. You must be punished by execution. Take him away! <coughs> 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 Have you had enough fun? <laughs> well, I'm impressed. I guess you got more than just luck on your side. I've been putting together my militia. Isn't this the perfect place? The authorities won't suspect a thing. You came all this way to tell me that. And he's to be executed, right? 
That's not news to me. But are you sure you want to share that news with your enemies? I mean, you are working for the Shogunate, aren't you? That's not something I can overlook. But what does that matter in the end? It would be a waste to kill you now. We are not done with each other, I'm afraid. So, Katsura and the others at the Sakura Inn, I'm sure. Come join us there. I'll buy you a drink. I'm guessing by that look on your face that you haven't found Fumi yet. Pardon me. Hmm? <sighs> Taka? Oh. Fumi! <gasps> You're alive! Uh, yes. Taka, helped me escape. Now there's nothing to hold us back. But I'm not sure I understand. I'm sure there is much you wish to know. But please, save your questions. There is news of great import I must convey to you at once. An up. 
uprising by the Satsuma clan is imminent. Should you join forces with them and succeed, you will surely be able to clip the Shogunate's wings. Perhaps end in this purge you once and for all. Hmm, you're right. We need to be a part of this. The Satsuma clan is every bit as powerful as the Choshu. This is a godsend. Hardly. The Satsuma are obsessed with all things Western. They cannot be trusted. Joining forces with them is folly. Listen to me, Genzui. I want you to decide. As Master Shoin's favorite student, it is you who is heir to his vision. I vow to help you in any way that I can. Your time has come. Rise as one. Master. I will listen to my heart and walk the path we believed in. Let us join the Satsuma. To correct Japan's course, we must put our petty differences aside and embrace what we share. What say you? Do I have your support? <laughs> Please come and see me later in Yoshiwara. I wish to speak to you alone. So you decided to join us. The Blue Demon's forces are marching on Princess Atsuko. It seems there is dissent in the Shogun's ranks. If they take custody of the Princess, the Satsuma clan will become hostages. You're the one who brought Fumi back. You have my gratitude. Now we no longer have our hands tied. Leave this to us. You should get somewhere safe. Please, take care of yourself. I'll be waiting. Now to support the Satsuma. Are you ready? Princess Sato, we finally caught a rat. 
マナベ Who would have thought the stray cat would wander in? Still, you did well. You have my thanks. Out of the way. My lady, we will soon have dealt with the vermin in the grounds. I thank you. It seems all is going according to plan. I'm afraid I must bring something to your attention. What did you say? Thank you once again for your efforts. It pains me, but now we can do little more than wait. I will seclude myself in my inner chambers. You have no need to fear for me. Even the chief minister would not dare come for me there. With my stepfather now gone, the Satsuma clan will be shaken to its core. Its future depends on you and Saigo. But we lack experience, and our master is gone. You know Saigo better than anyone, do you not? Compensate for each other's weaknesses, and secure the clan's future. Yes, my lady. I thank you. Now, what did you say your name was? <laughs> what kind of answer is that? Everyone needs a name. Isn't that right, Princess Sato? What a curious individual. I look forward to speaking with you. When things calm down. Until next time. Please forgive me, my lord. I did not foresee the stubbornness of the princess. You have been taking matters into your own hands, it seems. But at least the princess has been subdued for now. Fine work, but you are relieved of your duties for now. Go, rest. Yes, sir. Are you lonely, dearest Taka? Well, hold on. I won't be long. And when I join you, I shall give you the most exquisite hairpin you have ever seen. With 
made arrangements to that end. That's true. Hmm. You always pop up at just the right moment, don't you? <sighs> Roma, look at this. Every last one of them is here to help us strike down the Red Demon. Hmm. <laughs> Truly an impressive sight. Firstly, I would like to thank you all for joining us. We all come from different domains, places with separate customs, different loyalties. In fact, some of our clans once opposed each other long ago. Yet we have cast aside our differences and come together. Truly a testament to Master showing. We must strike in the name of all who have been oppressed. Let us not forget the pain of Master Shoin and the countless others who have suffered. We will bring this darkness to an end and deliver divine retribution to the Red Demon! I am allowed as many guards as the Shogunate provides. Do you expect the Chief Minister to flout the rules? Fate to die at the hand of a long veiled edge. I could not help if I pledged to protect.
That's enough. We must retreat. Retreat now. With the failure of the assassination plot, the struggle between the Shogunate and those who opposed it entered its final decisive phase. Though he survived, Naosuke Yi was relieved of his duties, blamed for inciting the rebellion, and forced to leave public life. Come. Let us return to Hikune. <laughs> They were saying the trade talks are being suspended. And you mm. just believed them, did you? You try arguing. I don't welcome the taste <laughs> of steel, personally. Mm. Right? Wait, who are you? Time to die! In the wake of this incident, Shogunate authority plummeted as the rebellious samurai grew emboldened. The influence of the United States, which Yi had done so much to promote, waned, leaving the door open for the British to take their place. Look at this place. It's more like a fortress. Indeed. With the Americans fading from the scene, the British are making a show of their power. When they finish that damn thing, we're in trouble. We'll never get them out. Kasaka! Hmm? Hmm? Yamagata, what took you so long? Anito, glad you could make it. <laughs> it's a terrible shame what happened to Master Shoen. <laughs> but mark my words. I will personally make sure his death wasn't in vain. Mr. Takasugi, it's been quite a while. Ito, I've got a job for you. I want you to put on a firework show. And by that you mean... destroying a certain building? Exactly. Now the Red Demon's gone, the foreigners are next. Let's torch them in the cholera they brought. The smoke will rise as a beacon for our cause. Damn you to hell! You savage! 
I'm glad you have a talent for arson. Why are you so intent on provoking the British? It saved me the trouble of provoking the British. Too far. This is just the beginning. Wake up, people of Japan. As the smoke rises, so shall we. So shall we! And this, this is no better than the Red Demon. That place would have been a breeding ground for cholera. We were right to burn it to the ground. Speaking of cholera, a firework display to honor all who have died is to be held by the Sumida River. It's a shameless attempt to carry favor with the masses. But I'm all for fireworks. Blaze bright and vanish. Hell, that's how I want to go. Listen up, men. It's time we began the next stage of the plan. The Red Demon is dead, and the British legation in ashes. We have the momentum to finish off the Shogunate. We'll take control and defend our land from the West's control. Hear, hear, and forge the world, Master Shoin, in vision. Then I have a proposition for the next step in ousting the Shogunate. Kill Kaishu Katsu! Glad you're keeping up. With the Red Demon gone, he is at the heart of the Shogunate. And word is, he'll be attending the fireworks. Katsu? I've heard he's just another aspiring windbag. Is killing him even worth the trouble? It's the aspiring ones that you have to watch. Not that I need to rely on a drunkard for advice. Let's keep numbers low, to avoid drawing attention. Ready to head to the river and finish him? We can't afford to miss this chance. We'll have plenty more opportunities to drink. Great. We're counting on you. Sakamoto, you'll join us, won't you? I guess. If it's what Master Shoin would have wanted. I appreciate it. I'll go ahead and scope it out. Let us meet at the Azuma Bridge. Shogunate. 
fighting is such a bore. Someone should collect all the army's gunpowder. Then we could really have a firework display. The rebels went too far, but they're right to want war. The Shogun, they killed Master Shogun! So you're going to overthrow the Shogun? Fine, then what? Surely you don't think you can sink the black ship with that sword. If you've got a better idea, I'm all ears. Well, got something? I do, actually. I plan to build Japan a navy. With black ships of our own, foreigners will think twice before sailing into our waters. <laughs> Am I wrong? <laughs> As for the Shogunate, you're not wrong. It's a lame duck. Seen from the inside, that's clear as day. But have you considered it'd be quicker to fix it than to spend all your time overthrowing it? So how about it? Do you two want to help me out? Murder, arson. Is that what Shoin wanted? Sana, but uh, I'm sorry. Uh, I'm just too busy to be thinking about things like that right now. Oh? Are you trying to <laughs> weasel out of your promise? Well, if you're intent on denying me that... <laughs> then fight me instead! <sighs> okay, okay. But you know how I've never been able to stop myself from going easy on you. Oh. Well, my friend here is just as strong as me. Why don't you fight them instead? <sighs> fight them, you say? <sighs> I have my doubts, but if it will finally make you deliver on your promise. I consent. I warn you, I won't lose. Dioma will be mine. Well, I'd love to stay and watch, but I think you need some privacy. That's enough for today, I think. I'll be going. <sighs> Thank you so much. I am truly grateful to you. Now I can finally go back to studying cures for cholera. Could I ask another favor? Would you be so kind as to track down Dr. Narasaki. He was rounded up during the recent purge, and he's still in custody. I heard he had just come up with a concoction that eased the symptoms of cholera. I have my work cut out rebuilding this medical facility. In the meantime, I would very much like you to speak to him for me. Please do this for me. And if ever you need anything, you know where to find me. Bravo! So you're Dr. Narasaki, are you? Just sit tight for a second. You find the key? 
<laughs> that woman is quite something. This is madness, Odeo. What were you thinking? But I owe you my thanks. Now, what do you want? I'm sure you didn't rescue me out of purely goodwill. They locked me up, and now they want my help. <sighs> well, whatever it takes to ease people's suffering. Cholera treatment. You must mean the medical school in Kanda. There will be an uproar if I don't show up soon. I'll be off. Wait, are we all right? I'm Ryoma Sakamoto. We're both Ryos. This must be a sign. Can I see you again? A sign, you say? Hmm, maybe I'll give you a chance. Not bad. When Katsu told me he had arranged some entertainment, he must have meant you. You... You have a curious sense of humor, you know? I am sorry. At Katsu's request, I did not inform the French side that this was merely a continuation of the training exercise. I intended to halt proceedings if things got out of hand. I never imagined a French base would fall. Well, well. It seems I was too hasty in writing this nation off. <laughs> I do not need pressure from you. Admiral Enomoto, I will train your men in French military technique. But there are conditions. I do not expect everyone to be of this warrior's caliber. But I need men who are willing to learn. Samurai who rush headlong into battle are mere cannon fodder. I care nothing for status. <laughs> I just need spirited young folks who I can teach to fight from scratch. Understood. We will start to recruit them without delay. I am grateful to you. I'm afraid I must remain here. May I ask one last thing of you? Find Tatsugoro Shinmon in Asakusa and tell him what we've discussed. I'd like him to help recruit some youngsters. Chief of the Firefighters. He's an old acquaintance of Katsu's, and I've met him a few times. A quirky fella, but he should be able to help. My thanks. <laughs> all right, all right. I get it. You're no run of the mill samurai. I'll give you that. And you caught those arsonists to boot. I can't very well ignore your request now, huh? Chief Tatsugoro, good to see you again. I believe you know why I've come to visit. I do. You want me to round up a bunch of young folks? Well, your wish is my command. Hundreds of young men with no prospects have come through my care. Many of them are more than willing to take up a good cause. Yeah. You just let him know he can leave everything to me. Thank you for your aid. Leave the rest to me. I'll report back to Katsu. Certainly showed me. Hmm? Ah! Hey, I know you. We met in Yoshiwara. <laughs> Mistaken identity, I am sure. <sighs> ah. 
I am Yoshinobu Tokugawa, the Shogun. The Shogun? Are you serious? <laughs> Seems I let the cat out of the bag. We had no intention of disrespecting you, uh, Your Excellency. Hey, <laughs> where are your manners? No need to be concerned. Losing to you was invigorating. Invigorating? Indeed. I mean, you dodged the shuriken. Finding warriors like you is no easy feat. Ah, the next bout. With warriors of this caliber, I know I can get Japan back on its feet. I will make our nation the equal of any foreign land. You wait and see. Enough, don't you think? Zoji, you're here too, I see. Hmm. You put on quite a show. This is Soji Okita of the Tenen Rishinryu. I'm Kondo, and this is Ichikata. Also of the Tenen Rishinryu. You would do well in our most elite unit, the Roshigumi. We've hooked ourselves a big fish. How come you're here? Master Katsu had us follow you at a distance. If only we had not lost sight of you. Worry not. I'm much obliged. That Katsu. Always one step ahead. I suppose I owe you my thanks as well. I'm afraid I have no idea. All I know is that he single-handedly disposed of my retainers. Get some ninja to look into that old man, will you? I'd prefer to have seen those criminals tried, but I suppose the result would have been the same. Sorry to have troubled you. Whatever, Mr. Sun. I'm afraid we ain't hugging! How dare you demand a toll? The Choshu clan has urgent business with the Imperial Court. Let us part! We couldn't care less what business you have. If you want to go to Kyoto, you'll have to cough a little something up first. <laughs> <laughs> Samurai are no much for our boys combined, hey? <laughs> Wait till the nobles try to get through here. We're about to be rich. 
A manly drinking contest. Oh. <coughs> if you insist, my dear. You are a lovable one, aren't oh. you? Oh, you can really drink, can't Don't you? Don't be shy. Drink, drink. Hey, huh? what's an expulsionist doing with the beer? We'll expel the foreigners, but their drinks can remain. Come by. Come by. Don't forget me. Come by. Looks like I'm up next. Give us a good one. All right. Well, I'd have expected your Roshigumi to be here by now. Patience. You're too anxious. The Roshigumi are on their way to Kyoto, I assure you. What happens next is anyone's guess. Nothing. We both know your real goal is to weaken the Shogunate from within. Perhaps. But what to do with all those fine warriors? Their skills could be useful. In a number of ways. In any case, it depends on the course you decide to take. You await a favorable response. The culture this nation still calls its own is worthy of admiration. If only I could say the same for all of its people. A real shame. The thing is, we're not really part of either faction. I know that whichever path we choose, we'll be doing it for Japan's future. Wow, well, is it time already? Is anyone else going to show? Looks like everyone's here. We're now going to negotiate directly with Lord Katamori to offer our services in Kyoto. All who have the guts, follow me! Shogun arrived in Kyoto. The city has been in constant turmoil. So I find your proposed army the most intriguing idea. Very well. They shall keep the peace in the city. And from now on, let them be known as the Shinsengumi.
Nakaoka! You did well to make it such a long way. The days of the Shogunate are over, Kusaka. It's been a pleasure fighting alongside you. Nah. Choshu troops are in the mountains ready for battle. I pull some strings and have a sizable army under my command now. If my Kihetai join you, the Shogunate doesn't stand a chance. You know it! <laughs> Kusaka, we have the advantage. Just say the word, and your troops will be ready to march! Great. No sign of Katsura? He was attacked by the Shinsengumi at Ikeda Inn. He managed to get away, it seems. But we are not sure where he is now. I see. In that case, do you remain firm in your resolve? Yes. Your troops have come a long way and given us a golden opportunity. It is time to live up to Master Shoen's ideals. When I fled my clan in Tosa, it was your clan that took me in. It's time for me to repay the favor. No. Oh. <laughs> Will you let bygones be bygones and fight the Choshu alongside me? I am not sure the Satsuma clan will be all that useful on the unfamiliar terrain of Kyoto. I assure you that is not the case. Your forerunner, Lord Shimazu, possessed foresight. He traded with Britain for the latest weaponry and prepared for this day. He demanded that the Shogunate embrace reform. Hmm. Truly, he was a loyal servant of the Shogun, an example to all. If the Satsuma clan remain bonded closely with me, we can realize the ideals of your predecessor. You think the same, don't you? British cannons pack quite a punch, don't they, Saigo? The Joshua are all but defeated. Let us leave the rest to the foot soldiers. No, we must wipe them out to a man. Continue the bombardment. Hurry, over here! <laughs> Joshua are more spineless than I thought. <laughs> if this retreat continues, Kyoto will be burned to ashes. So you are behind this? It takes you back, doesn't it? This smell. Back to that day. The day when we died. But one before! Soon enough, the Shogunate, the whole country, will be engulfed in flames. This is the world we longed for, is it not? Once you 
have the foreigner's weapons. The rest is easy! One small farm will start an inferno that engulfs the nation! It is in times of strife! But we must need it! See? I've kept us relevant. You and me. Blade twins. The two of us as one. Join me. Someone told me that the Shogunate is already dead. So I must be reborn. An usher in a new world. What that world looks like is still shrouded in darkness. But there are those who are feeling their way towards the light. A new dawn. I fight alongside those who bring it about. And so, I cannot join you. I thought... I thought you would understand. You of all people. to the winds. May they escape alive and realize our master's dream for a new world. Ito, Yamagata, Nakaoka, Katsura, Shinsaku, Fumi. How I wish I could see you one last time. Master Shoin. I am ready to join you now. August 1864. Genzui Kusaka took his own life. He was 25 years old. Brother's dream. For all our sakes, he wanted to build us a new Japan. I'm afraid I would never understand. How can you create a peaceful world through war? It is in times of strife. When we are most needed. This is the world we longed for, is it not? We can't let the juicy rubble escape! <laughs> Haven't you had enough? The battle is over! Come! We're putting a stop to this. There's been enough bloodshed. Kondo would be grateful for fighters with your skills. Perhaps you might consider... No. Never mind. <coughs> you did well to stop him. Now, let's get Shinsaku out of here. We should be able to get him to the Chosho's Kyoto estate. 
With all of this going on, I'm hoping the defenses there have thinned. He's in trouble if we don't get him to a doctor right away. Come on, let's hurry! If it wasn't for you, I would have been done for. I seriously thought it was the end for me. But thanks to you, I live to tell the tale. It was Oreo who saved you, really. <laughs> I didn't know you were such an expert. The expert is my father. All I did was follow his instructions. To you and your father, I could never thank you enough. If you had not come, many lives would have been lost. And I must say, your arrival was a very nice surprise. I never thought this would be my chance to see you again. <laughs> it seems too good to be true, doesn't it? Clearly, fate has something in store for the two of you. Uh, I... I don't know about that. <laughs> that aside, uh, what happened to Katsura? Do you know where he is? No. He vanished after the incident they get in. But then this letter arrived here, just this morning. Let's see here. I'm in Kamogawa. Your time has come. Rise as one. And do you think this is Katsura? I can't say for certain. But anyone who would know Master Shon's last words must have seen his end. You're right. That way we'll know for sure. Katsura's the man in charge. If he doesn't show his face soon, it's going to be hard to keep everyone in line. Regretfully, I would have to leave this one up to you. I'm still not too steady on my feet. Also, it feels like I'm coming down with a cold. <coughs> Hmm, not a problem. We'll head there as soon as we're ready. There's a longhouse you can use in Kyoto. Rest up there. Once you're all set, join me in Kamogawa. Be careful, Ryoma. I will. Just look after Shinsaku, won't you? Blades with someone with no intention to kill is pointless. You said you would like to speak to me. <sighs> the Satsuma never chose to begin this fight. That decision was the Shogunate's. Forget the Shogunate. I want to speak to you, not them. It was the Choshu who drew their swords first. 
And considering their behavior in Kyoto, how can we leave them be? Look, I understand Satsuma's perspective. Mm. But have you thought about our future? What do you mean? Hmm. Change this country? You, what are you saying? Saigo, deep down, I know you agree with me. There are things Satsuma can only accomplish with Choshu by its side. You want us to march alongside our sworn enemies? I simply cannot see it. And yet, it can be so. If we should will it. But first, I should apologize. I am sorry. I could not stop the conflict earlier. <gasps> Katsura of the Choshu? What are you wearing? Oh, ignore these filthy rags. I assure you, my aspirations remain unsullied. As my associates have said, we must put aside our differences. Even if it means moving heaven and earth, we must transform Japan. Katsura, I... I hear you. I accept your proposal. <clears throat> Gesho, too, would have been glad to put an end to the bloodshed. Then it's settled that Josho and Sazuma will join forces, and we shall be the ones to see it through. You know, I've heard that in the West you're meant to hold hands and shake them on occasions like this. Go on, try it. <sighs> Saigo, I look forward to working with you. Hmm. The pleasure is mine. <laughs> Don't you remember what I told you back then? That I had a dream as big as the damn ocean. <laughs> <laughs> This way. Okay, plan. Ah, this is a real mess. <laughs> uh. <clears throat> After being attacked at the Terada Inn, Ryoma Sakamoto took refuge amongst the Satsuma clan. Might not be so lucky next time. I'm going to have to leave things to you for now. 
I'm counting on you. Hmm. The day of reckoning is at hand. We joined forces with the Satsuma clan, but barely escaped with our lives. How long can this alliance last? I fear it is built on sand. If we want to avenge Kusaka's death, we must act now. Genzui is dead. Shinsoku sick. And the Ryoma missing. Frankly, we need all the help we can get. I'm going to need you on our side. Actually, that may not be necessary. <laughs> well, well, look who it is. I figured you for dead. <laughs> or did you strike a deal with the Lord of Death? <laughs> I'm more surprised to see you still alive. I thought you'd be passing me on the way to hell. Sorry for all the worry I caused. But fear not, Oryo has fixed me up. Now, without further ado, I've got a solution to your problems. With my plan, we won't even need to fight. Really? Look, it's not that I don't trust you. Let's just say that staring death in the face can be inspirational. <clears throat> There's no time to waste. We have to show this to Lord Yoshinobu. I intend to return this nation to a better era, but certain people will need to be removed. Yoshinobu Tokugawa, the last shogun. A fine title for a history book, wouldn't you say? restored to its rightful state. And who better to guide it than me? One who truly understands Japan! So, that's what you're after. Throw him in the cells. We can't afford to antagonize Britain right now. You will be prey to the great powers. The sacred soul of this land will be lost, I tell you. <laughs> what an odd fellow. No. I fear he's hit the nail on the head. Sometimes others see us more clearly than we see ourselves. You believe that drivel? Would you please take the time to look this over? I really think this might be the answer. At least, that's what I hope. Relinquish power only to launch an offensive? That is nonsense. Someone is clearly trying to frame me. To drive a wedge between me and the new administration. I will not ignore this calumny! You believe us to be behind this? I beg your pardon. My lord, you are not safe here. We must get away and fast. Hmm. So 
so you feel no need to flee, I take it? going to change their minds. Ryoma, answer me this. If the Shogun remains in the administration, how can that be a fresh start for our nation? The Tokugawa will contrive to take control again. Then they will surely crush us. The time has come to settle things with firearms. Them. Who cares who comes out on top? The main thing is to find a solution that works for us all. Well, come on then. Do you have a plan? Uh, uh, well, you know, uh, how can I put it? Uh, um. <laughs> <laughs> I thought as much. Listen, let's think of something together. We've come this far after all. <sighs> Thank you. That would be very welcome. At this rate, there'll be no winners at all. You still need to clean up this country. You need to li live. It was a bad influence on you, but I've taken care of that. You can't stop the war. No one can. This nation will descend into chaos. And why would you want to? This is the world we longed for. It's here at last. Yoma! Shintaro has been wounded. He needs a doctor. I've finally seen it. The new shape this country must take. I'll get help. Don't try to speak. We must <laughs> gather everyone with nobility, regardless of social status. Farmers, craftsmen. Decisions should be made by a parliament. A forum where we can exchange ideas. A new dawn is breaking. I see it so clearly. I'll leave the rest to you. You are my true partner. There is no need for an epic battle. We merely need to show them the difference in our strength. Indeed, our men vastly outnumber their own. Once the fighting starts, they will surely see the error of their ways. Indeed, I am eager to discuss peace terms. If this drags on, we risk falling prey to foreign powers. I secured your release. You might show some gratitude. Thanks to you, the negotiations have soured considerably. Now, about those weapons you have for sale. We'll take all you have.
name is Jules Brunet. It is an honor to fight alongside such renowned samurai. We've been expecting you. My name is Kondo, the Shinsengumi. My Denshudai troops have finished training and are ready for battle. brought his ship around. Please, you must escape to Edo. Never! If I flee now, the Shogun, it's over! But that's exactly what they're hoping for. Should you fall to your enemies here, war will rack the entire nation. <sighs> Lord Katamori, if you would. You burn with a desire for vengeance. The enemy's commander has fled. Now is the time. The heavens have granted us our chance. The Shogun's troops are on the verge of retreat. Let's give this everything we have! Fire!
Shogunate forces outnumbered the enemy. With the retreat of the Shogun, defeat was at hand. The Shogun's life is not in danger, but still he must rest up for now. I just can't understand it. Why didn't we stand and fight? With my fleet, it was a battle we could have won! We were following the Shogun's orders. He did not wish for us to fight. And frankly, Enomoto, I believe he means to lay down his very life for the million citizens of Edo. And you will allow this? You are a samurai! Is it not your duty to protect your lord and master? It is indeed. And that's why I have a very important job for you. Enomoto must take His Excellency and his men to safety overseas. The people of Edo, too, should use what ships they have to escape. Escape, you say? You can't be serious. After that, we will set Edo ablaze. I have already told Chief Tatsugoro of the firefighters our plan. We will destroy anything useful to our enemies. When they are weakened, we'll have a chance to negotiate. You really mean to sacrifice Edo? If Edo were to become a battlefield, it would be utter carnage. Countless citizens would perish. No, this is the only way. The restoration is nigh. And all shall burn. The Sekihotai will see it done. Messenger for Princess Atsuko. Princess Atsuko? I make the following plea with all my heart. I had thought. Princess Atsuko to be a mere hostage of the Shogunate, but it seems that her concern is not for her own life. She wants a world fit for all of those who have sacrificed so much. This goes beyond the Shogunate or the Revolutionist Army. Princess Atsuko is wiser than us all. I have read her message. Now, I must speak to Katsu. I wanted to make a world where we could live together. Just let me die. By your hand.
Thank you for stopping me. Just like the people we hated. My only goal in life was to create a nation where we could thrive. And you're telling me to just give up? Hmm. Why not? It's a new dawn for Japan. It could be for you, too. No. I wish to leave this land. I'll watch things unfold from some far-off place. Even if we are apart, still we are one. Separately formidable. Together, unstoppable. Blade twins are forever tied together by the bonds of fate. The age of the samurai draws to a close. The samurai spirit lives on, and new horizons await.